friends welcome back to my channel I hope you all are doing well so let's get into this video real quick um, I'm opening my Amazon package uh, today is January 20th and I ordered this I think uh, a couple days ago and um, it's here so I ordered a, a waffle slash pancake maker from Amazon by the brand Cucina Pro uh, this is my first time ordering this brand and um, first time ordering this uh, kind of a, a gadget so let's take a look I'm excited to uh, you know try this out because um, my son wanted um, pancakes uh, for breakfast uh, in bed uh, for his birthday so I thought these uh, little cute animal shape you know animal faces shaped pancakes will um, you know um, be uh, you know make him happy so uh, something special just for his birthday so I'm excited to try it so I'm opening it here and let's take a look um, I will say it's come packaged pretty well you know so I don't see any damage that's the booklet instruction manual and let's take the plastic off I own something similar it's like a quesadilla maker but that wasn't a really good quality so um, I ended up returning that so let's see how this one is so that's how it looks on the inside and a little close-up view these are non-stick plates and those are animal faces I see cat a raccoon, a dog, um, so that's that, and then um, I'm using some, uh, you know, a biscuit mix to make the batter. This is just a store-bought um, pancake mix or, you know, waffle mix, and all you need is the, the mix and water that's all you need so I'll just be mixing up about two cups of the Bisquick uh, powder mix with a cup and a half of water just plain water and mix that up Yep, so two cups of that, of the mix and water, just the instructions. I think we all know how to mix, <laughs> uh, you know, like make a batter, so there's no not rocket science but um, I just thought I would show you step by step and um, my trusty whisk and whisk away so make sure you break all the lumps and then the manual the instruction manual I cleaned um, the plates the, the surface the inside with like a damp paper towel so it's clean and I will turn on the machine I plugged it in and um, once it's ready to go the green light turns on letting you know that it's you know it's ready for the batter so I'm just waiting for the, the green signal and that's my batter that's the consistency and um, I think it takes a good um, two, two to three minutes to heat up so I'm trying to show you guys the green because um, the daylight is so bright 
so wet so the green light is on and I think you even hear like a click sound when that light comes on and then I'm using some um, olive oil as you know to lightly grease the um, the pan or the uh, you know the plates and then I've put my batter in there and the manual says to uh, set a timer or you know check between three and four minutes if it's done so there's no auto shut off in this case so you basically just you know put a timer for I put a timer for four minutes and I checked on um, the little pancakes and um, I think I was just waiting for the timer to yeah I was reading the manual and just making sure on the time so um, This is my first time doing like a voiceover and I am, <laughs> it's uh, um, I'm just trying for the first time. So, okay, so our pancakes are done and I must say those look pretty cute. Um, they didn't brown completely on the other side. Um, so I'm not sure if it was uh, my if I hadn't greased it enough or but it looks uh, you know the shape looks really cute and they seem uh, to be done from um, at least the bottom side nice and golden brown they don't look quite exactly like the picture on the box but um, this is the second batch that I tried and I you know greased it a little bit more and with this one I also flipped it um, you know just to brown the other side but um, that's the result so anyway um, um, just my dog's waiting there for his share. <laughs> yes.